The Varsity Show at Columbia University is a time-honored and prestigious tradition. In its 127th year, our documentary crew was allowed a glimpse into the creative process of the student-driven musical. What you are about to see is a depiction of extreme student theater comprising the best the Ivy League has to offer. This week on The Varsity Show, we examine the audition process that young actors are subject to on their way to Columbia University theater stardom. Oh dear God, that was dreadful. Quick, someone pull up the next video before the ghosts of Rodgers and Hammerstein come from my head. Oh, absolutely. You're gonna love this one. She would fit in so naturally with the cast. I mean, from a writing perspective, she's got it all. Versatility, and uh, enthusiasm, and uh, uh, Just share the video. Ah, uh, okay. Hey, what up, Vape Nation? It's your girl Maddie fucking Smokes. Back at it again with another sick Nick challenge. Let's go. <laughs> For the uh, talent portion of my audition, I'm going to be blowing a fatty cloud in the air, inhaling it through my nose, out my ears. <laughs> Enjoy. What was that? Look. She would be so great for the stoner role in scene two. No! She'd be the perfect socialist lead! The vape hotbox? She's clearly the stoner. Are you even hearing yourself? She's edgy. She's hip. She's the socialist! No! Yes! Ah! It's been really hard keeping things on track ever since the writers fused into this corporeal form. All of those hours brainstorming and rewriting dialogue, all that time spent together somehow changed them. They lost their minds and their bodies. We didn't even hear her sing. I mean, for all we know, she could have a bad case of popcorn lung. How can we cast someone if we don't even hear them sing? That didn't stop you from wanting to cast Allison. Hello, this is Allison. Um, I'm a sophomore in CC studying English, and this is my own audition. Oh, what a noble mind is here overthrown. The courtiers, the scholars, the soldiers, I, tongue, sword. I mean, what can I say? I'm a stickler for Hamlet. Let's just, let's just table it and move to the next auditioner. We clearly haven't found the next Patti Lapone, so uh, I don't know why everyone's picking favorites. Coming right up, Chief. On the outside, always looking in, will I ever be more than I've always been? Cause I'm tap, tap, tapping on the glass, waving through a window. I try to speak, but nobody can hear, so I Next. Hello, my name is Sally, and here are just some of the many impressions you'd get if you cast me. On my own, pretending he's beside me, all alone, I walk with him till morning. Without him, I feel his arms around me, and when I lose my way, I close my eyes and he's found me. Oh baby, the babe which shines like silver All the lights are misty in the river <sighs> Next Debbie It's like a guarantee oh. <laughs> Sorry <laughs> It's like a, oh, sorry. It's, it's like, oh, sorry. 
it's like a gar- <sighs> uh, Sorry. It's like a- it's- it's- it's like a guarantee. Hmm. Sorry. Now do you see what I'm dealing with here? We just need to scrap the cast and I'll play every role. That's what the people want. Besides, I would be great as Presbo. <clears throat> La, sorry. La, I just need to get the voice right because it's a different voice because I'm acting. La da, that's the register. <clears throat> Attention teachers and students, I am pleased to announce that Associate Dean Ira Katznelson has just been promoted to a unit of time. See, it's not that difficult. Ah, uh, so, who's next? That was the last one. <clears throat> well then, let's get them out of the waiting room and see if they can dance. Welcome all to our, uh, our dance callback. Anyway, um, our, our wonderful choreographer is gonna teach you a few moves and we, we just wanna see how you pick them up. <clears throat> All right. Three, two, one. Does she mean five, six, seven, eight? When she said she was to work on Broadway, I was so excited to have a really experienced choreographer on our team. Now I'm starting to think she meant the M&M world in Times Square. Time to be firm and stand our ground. Hold on to the dream. Barnard will not be pushed around. We'll reign I've got this. I was Jesus in CMDS Presents Godspell, Sweeney Todd in CMDS Presents Sweeney Todd, Elphaba in CMDS Presents Wicked, and a small but very important supporting role in Xmas 13. I'm even making this fake cast to accurately portray this character from a really indie unknown show. It's obvious they'll cast me. Time to be firm and stand our ground. Hold on to the dream. Barnard will not be pushed around. You're out. God damn it! <laughs> Don't talk to me! <laughs> Alright, the rest of you, great job. Great job. I'm starting to think this isn't KCST. So does that mean the rest of us are in? Well, I am so excited to announce. Drum roll, please. You will hear back in 48 to 72 hours. Yeah. Ta-ta.